Hey, what's up guys? So I just want to do a video comparison of the two monopolies, uh, the electronic banking versus ultimate banking. By the way, I heard that these are out of print. I don't know for sure, at least I'm not seeing these at a store anymore. I want to check on Amazon, see if they have them. Um, I've seen a few of them, uh, like these ones. Maybe not exactly the same as this one, but but maybe at least uh, similar to the ones in here. But yeah, there might be still out there in Amazon, but I'm not seeing these ones at, a, at, at stores anymore. All right, so the first thing is uh, they fold the opposite uh, ways. So check this out. So if I do this, so boom. Boom and boom. So I'm gonna now unfold. And boom, there you go. So this Monopoly electronic banking is pretty much the same as the original Monopoly. Uh, th uh, this one is just uh, has uh, different property names. And uh, also, yeah, this one doesn't have like the 10% or something. Uh, there it only has like pay 2 million or whatever. The other thing is that uh, here it's not railroads, it's actually airports. And also, um, there's a, I'm just, as you can, if you can see there, there's uh, services here um, instead of a, uh, so this one is like cell phone service right here and uh, internet service there. Um, yeah, so there's, over here there's a, uh, services instead of uh, utilities so that's one that's the other thing that's um, different about this particular monopoly as opposed to this one the ultimate banking this one actually has only nine spaces uh, from corner to corner there are no railroads or airports for that matter but um, this is what makes it go faster and plus if you um, the other thing is um, if you notice uh, here we got uh, chance and community chest, like the original Monopoly. Um, here there's only this, is what it's what, what is called an event cards. Uh, we'll get to that in a minute. This here is a is a teleportation. This is a um, teleport. You can if you stand on it, you you, you have the choice of either just stay here or you can move anywhere you pay a hundred um, dollars or whatever uh, you just pay a hundred and you just move anywhere on the board you like so i'm just i guess to any property or wherever you want to move to this game actually is tricked by the rules actually <laughs> um uh yeah that's this is what the one the other thing that one makes it go faster is because um of the free parking you, you, if you, you cannot put um, a card the uh, the debit or whatever uh, the card that uh, we'll get to the cards in a minute as well but you cannot put anything on the free parking so the free parking you just stay there it's just like visiting it's just like visiting here okay Okay, unlike this original game, like, um, what people have made up <laughs> is that, that you put, uh, cash or whatever on free parking and, uh, whatever, uh, winnings or whatever, if you pay, you pay for some kind of, uh, whatever, is it they telling you to pay, people put it on the free parking instead of uh, to the bank, and that was what's making it making the game last longer and <laughs> but there are a few people that actually play by the rules and and actually make monopoly play a lot faster um, but uh it's just uh the people made some custom rules and that's <laughs> that's what's making it making it monopoly play last longer so you choose whatever it is that you, how you want to play it. You, if you want to play faster, you want to play. If you want to, if you want to play a lot faster, or uh, 
or go or go with you can go with this one if you want to play uh, really long then get my not play whatever you want to make custom rules or whatever it is you want to do uh, but this is not this video is not about how to play monopoly this is just versus monopoly this versus this one okay so um, let's get to the setup now so of course you got the uh, the guide booklets uh, that tells about this game here and um, this game here pretty straightforward right so as you can see already about something about this game that that these have different this one has the uh, numbers um that has the pun uh punching the numbers in here um uh, and has uh, like a minus and subtracting and adding the numbers whatever um that's that's one thing and as opposed to this one only has three buttons and uh, and uh, always only scans the cards um so uh, all the cards, uh, the, all those cards, all scannable, all of them are scannable. This one actually uh, has um, a six-player game. Um, let me do that. So this one has six, six players. And I really, it doesn't matter um, how you get them. But uh, anyways, you just pick whatever it is that you want to, you know, which one you want to. Uh, it doesn't really matter. You you can even you can pick any any piece. Um, so any piece you want. The one you got the uh, you got the metal pieces here. Oops, uh, that's that's a hotel. <laughs> um, anyways, um, you you got the uh, the uh, what is this a race car or whatever? Um, there's the race car. Anyways, um, got the cell phone. So let's you got the hamburger right here you got the uh, skateboard here there it is skateboard of course you got the airplane <laughs> yep um, and you also got a rollerblade so let's see um, yep you got six one two three yep you got six um, Six tokens or six pieces, whatever it is you want to call them. Um, but yeah, six um, debit cards for like six players that you can uh, go along with the with this game. Um, but really, it doesn't matter uh, which which of the cards and which pieces go with it. So it's totally up to you. Um, but as opposed to. Um, um, hang on a second. Well, of course, here the chains. Uh, oh, I forgot this one. This is another one. Six players. <laughs> I showed you five, right? This is, a, um, <laughs> uh, there's six. Just to make sure I have it right. There you go. Six. I mean, yeah. It's got six. Just to want to make sure there are six of them. And these are the chains on community chests. There you go, they're black and white like this. <laughs> um, anyways, so just like usual, but chains, community chest, just like original Monopoly. Um, but as opposed to this one here, let me just get to those in a minute. Well, no, not in a minute, now. Um, so he, here are the cards, right? As opposed to here, these cards actually has to be with the pieces. They actually have to go with the pieces. So you cannot have, like, you can't have play and go with the card or whatever. Because um, that's kind of incorrect. Because the, the, the bank tells you who's winning or who's, I mean, who's, uh, you know, who got what property or whatever. Um, so you can't really mess things up here. So, um, so there are the pieces. There's the car. This one, there's a, there are plastic ones here. <laughs> plastic pieces. So you got the helicopter. Um, you got the boat. Right? 
or the boat or a yacht, whatever it is um, that you want to call it. Um, um, <laughs> and uh, the, the jet, yeah. So, <laughs> but yeah, so these uh, cards has to go with the pieces. So, um, so there's a that. There is boom. There's that. Well, well, you you get the idea, right? Um, there's that, and there's this, and there's that. They just they have to actually have to go with the pieces. There's only f this one actually only has four players, up to four players. Um, so that's that's one thing. That's uh, that's another thing, actually. Um, that's different about this game. That, um, so this this game here has six players up to six players um, has metal pieces in here um, this one has plastic pieces and uh, up to only four players so let's get to the properties actually before we get to the properties let me show you the event cards which I told you in the beginning that we were going to get so this is just like a community chest and uh, and chance cards except this is only one and these are actually colorful so there that's how they look like right here so you got this here pretty much that's what they look like so yeah I'm not gonna go through them reading and reading everything <laughs> thing that, that, that I just show you really, really quick what they look like so um yeah that's that so and uh, as I was saying, like the uh, these event cards are scannable by this device here. So, uh, so you actually have to scan these cards. Um, that's that. And uh, as well as these properties, uh, that are, that are also scannable, and they are numbered. From 1 through 22, there are 22 properties um, in here, and they're all scannable. You, you know how in the original game you actually have to buy houses um, here, houses and hotels and everything, all that. You, you, you know, you, you know, you know all that, right? Right. That's that's uh, you know, and and most people buy buy and like, build houses and hotels on this on, on this place right here, right? Right, and uh, already less likely that they would go into, and very less likely someone would ever build here, here because it's expensive to build on, right? And and you know, that, that that's what happens, <laughs> and that's what's uh, going on here. So, uh, what's cool about this game is that you don't have to pay for houses. As I was saying, I was uh, I told you that in the. In the in my other previous other previous video that are in the gameplay of this monopoly here that um, as soon as you um, land on a property you actually get a house yes you I can actually this bank tells you that that you as soon uh, as soon as you do just scan scan the card um, it'll uh, tell you that you it'll deduct um, from it'll deduct from your whatever balance and uh, it'll tell you that you have one house so I didn't actually show you close up let me just show you that real quick so you turn that on here yeah. and as you can see right here I don't know if you can see oh right there let's just suppose that two players are helicopter and a jet And uh, once you do that, you check, and you got, uh, and you just roll, uh, roll the dice, whatever you land on. Um, and let, let's just suppose you, you bought something. So you're gonna scan this card. It tells you what number it is actually on the property for the property and then you're gonna scan 
whatever whatever card landed on. So, so let's suppose this this card got the property. Oops, <laughs> and now let's try that again. So there's a, there it is. There it is right here. And I'm gonna put that here. And check this out. Huh. Okay, deducted. And as you can see, one. House one. And uh, suddenly, uh, you got one house. So you, you can actually put a house right on the property. Right? <laughs> um, yeah, so that's pretty much how you, how you play it. Um, and every time you... Um, and then every time a player lands on it, Either you or somebody else um, lands on the property, the rent, I mean, the, the house level goes up. That's, so as you can see, there's a rent level right here. Um, all the rent level there. As opposed to over here, when you're buying a property, yeah, you actually have to like put the card inside here. And actually, you know, see how much it is. It's, uh, let's just say, you put one and uh, M. And that's how you did that, deduct from your card. So, um, once you, if you want to buy a property or something. But, um, and if you are paying to somebody, you actually have to um, put uh, this card. And somebody else's card. So say it's somebody. Uh, so as you can see. Um, let's just say it's. Uh, oh, uh, 350k. For a bo uh, boardwalk or park place. Whatever it is. Um, um, it's right here. <coughs> there. Um, there's the. 350 so it says there so go 350 and there you go so you, you can even check that, um, that your balance went down uh, went down and the uh, balance went up here there you go. Um, so that's uh, basically how how you uh, play along with this game. So, and this is the go button. You just if you if you press and go, just you know, just put the card in, and you just press this, and that's how you how you uh, collect uh, for press and go. And with this one, you just let's assume that uh, someone has passed um, pass go and wants to you know pass go and click to uh, whatever was that two hundred uh, whatever dollars or whatever a million dollars whatever <laughs> whatever there's uh, it says two hundred there. So what you do is just uh, you click on M and once the symbol appears, um, you just put your card. Put whatever whoever is playing the card and that's how you collect uh, the the for pass and go so there you go um just just as easy as that <laughs> right so it's pretty simple pretty uh pretty cool thing oh by the way the uh, the event cards um when you scan one of these um these actually make a particular sound for example uh deal of the week so let's assume somebody landed an event uh, places and uh just and now it's saying uh put the property put your property there or whatever whatever property you got uh, so you just put that in and check this out the house level went up so you, you just move your house to um one or two, whatever it's saying to level your, your house, and, or if someone landed on your property, then you just move your house. Let me just, 
uh, do another um, thing that, about the teleportation. If, uh, if, if somebody landed on teleportation, so you just wait till a symbol uh, appears and now you put your card. It just deducted uh, 100 there. And now you can move to any space you want or any, any property you want on the board and pretty much uh, the same if you want to get out of jail you just uh, you just get the there's that you just paid to get out of jail and it'll tell you to uh, put your card it deducts uh, 100 and you're out of jail so that's how you put that in that's how you pay for the to get out of jail that's what's pretty much uh, what the difference is about uh, about these two games let me just uh, do one more card and see what sound does this one make house party so Oh, looks like, uh, wait a minute. Okay, it looks like the house went level up, I guess. Yeah. So, there you go. House level went up. If you want to turn it off, you just press and hold to turn it off. That's how you turn it off. There are only five levels to, um, and, and you would just take this house, and you just, you just have one house per property. And you would just... Move, move your house uh, whenever, either level up or level or level up or level down, or whatever. You just move your house. You, you you don't put, you know, a group of houses either one, two, or three because there's limit of how many houses there are. So you just so you you just move houses to a level, whatever level. It's telling you to move. Uh, so yeah. That's uh, that. So that's that. That's about the houses. So, um, uh, yeah, um, that's. Uh, so I guess that's pretty much it. Um, if there's anything I might have forgotten, um, let me know in the comments. Otherwise, um, I think that's just about it, so that I have covered everything. <laughs> um, that's uh, pretty much uh, what the difference between them. <laughs> so, um, I don't know, you guys can, you guys see whatever it is you want to, you know, this one goes a lot by pretty fast, then faster than this one. Yeah, as long as you play by the rules, um, you're going to play this one f uh, faster than you ever thought possible, but, um, uh, but, but because because uh, this one has cards, it might be a little bit slower. Um, but um, but see which one that is yeah, you want you want to go with this one. I guess I guess uh, more people like this one, and uh, I'm assuming that's what it is, because uh, uh, you know this one actually uh, like i already said this one has no 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 airports or no railroads as i said in the beginning so anyways um that's i suppose that's uh, i think that's just pretty much it so these makes sounds these properties are not properties the event cards and uh yeah pretty much i think that just wraps it up so, um, anyways, guys, I hope you, uh, liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Um, and, uh, yeah, um, comment, subscribe for more new videos coming in in your future. <laughs> um, yeah.